Super excited about today's video. We're gonna show you how to execute an awesome camo design using Mission Control gel paints right now on Nail School. Camo nail design, Tracy yeah. Ryerson, how do we do it? Well, camo print is pretty hot right now and we thought we'd show you a really easy way of doing it with Mission Control. Plus, we get a lot of questions about the process. How do we do creative? How do we pump out the type of designs that we do over and over five, six designs a week? So let me show you how to do that right now. So first thing we're gonna do is pull out the three colors we're gonna use. We're gonna use Mission Control Overdrive. Mission Control Clutch, and Mission Control Clash. We're using a full well tip on one of these plastic display pieces. We use some sticky tack. We put it on the back of the full well tip, and that's what we use to adhere it to the plastic display. First thing I'm going to do is I'm going to grab some Clash and I'm going to lightly touch Clutch and we're going to apply it to the whole surface of the nail, smearing both of the colors in together. I'm going to grab a little more Clutch, a little more brown, and just blend it in with that green. This is going to give us a nice color washed background to work on. Once we have that, we're going to cure this out for one minute. Once we've cured it out for one minute, we're going to add the camo print. At this point, we're going to use two of the colors, clutch and overdrive, the brown and the black. We're going to take clutch, get a little bit on our brush, and we're just going to wiggle it in random spots onto the nail. Once we have that, I'm going to clean my brush off and go into the black. Do the same thing. We're just going to get a little bit black of the black color on our brush. And again, we're just going to wiggle it in certain spots. Some of it's going to go a wrap around the brown. And for me, the, the print that I'm doing is kind of a combination between a cow print and a zebra print. Just a smear. If there's anything that you want to refine, you can wipe your brush off and clean up the spots. Once we have our print, we're going to cure it out for one minute. After we've cured that coat for one minute, we're gonna go to our finished top coat. We're gonna apply a nice amount from cuticle to free edge and get it in the light for a minimum of one minute. I personally like to cure all my top coats for two minutes. I think it gives it a higher shine and I have no problems. So here is our final camo nail that I did. Now here's the thing, a lot of times when I do just one nail, I may not like it at first. I need to see it as a full set. So I'm gonna go ahead and show you what it looks like when I finish the rest of the nails out. So now you can see our final design. What I like about doing it on the display is I can move the tips around and kind of get a mental idea of what it's going to look like on the hand. 
we wanted to show you the process and show you how we go about creating five to six different designs a week. Also, with camo being really popular right now, it gives you a really cool, simple way of doing some quick art on your clients' nails.